Welcome everybody, this is the Living Room Panner and I am in my living room. Welcome one and all, I hope y'all are home from a long day of work or doing something productive and just enjoying the AC or whatever it is you do in the afternoon evenings. I am home and it is time to kick off some more fun. All right, folks. Well, YouTube is in no way affiliated, sponsoring, or endorsing. This is just the old pattern here. All right. Well, the first thing we're going to talk about is I had a nugget bucket about a week ago, and there were 25 scoops in that nugget bucket, and here it is right here. It's all been gone through and cleaned up, and these are clean concentrates that I know for a fact have gold and silver in it. No coins, but gold and silver. And right now I'm auctioning off, or I have been auctioning off that tellings. And right now it's at $35 for that tellings. And I guarantee you, like I said, you're going to find silver shot and gold in there. And then the next thing we got is one of our community members, Casey Sering, decided he would sponsor and help my channel grow. And he offered for the... Uh, the Bentley's Pay Dirt, the small jar, and this is a sealed jar, and folks, I had this jar for probably maybe two years or more, and as soon as he decided he wanted to sponsor for this, I ordered a new jar of small, and let me tell you, the concentrates in it are very fine in the new stuff, but I paid more for the new one than I did for this one, so... This is an old jar, and he got a pretty sweet deal on it. This has supposedly got one plus grams of gold in it. So we're fixing to pan this out for KC Serene. I got everything ready, but I'm going to do a real quick update. So that's the info on the auction for the tailings. And then on my big time sponsor giveaway, which is a first place ASE 2012, a second place 1921 Morgan, Third place is a silver pack. And folks, we got three spots left. Number five, number nine, and number 17. Once we surpass those three spots, I'll be adding the copper pack in there. And once we surpass 25, I'll add a quarter gram of gold. And this is a $10 sponsor spot. So anybody that's interested in this, here's my Gmail once again. My winner's list has... Uh, it's grown a bit. I'm sure I'm missing somebody's name on here, but I know who, who's got what coming. And I'm probably going to start sending out buckets, bu bucket, uh, the gold bucket scoop, the, the nugget bucket. All the cleanup from that, I'm probably going to send all that stuff out on Monday, plus anything else accumulated. Now, my most recent video... I announced uh, again the fundraiser for Johnny Ray Highway Coins. And right now we are at eight prizes. One scoop of, from the Nugget Bucket, a silver round, two big time spots in my giveaway. Uh, Ron F's got a, a silver round. K and K's got two rows of 40 1940s Wheaties. And Nickel and Dime, Perry Barth, he's got two Canadian new. It's got the owl on it, and man, those are nice. So he's got those two prizes on there, and most of these prizes from other people will be sent directly from them. It's a $10 minimum donation to help Johnny Ray out, and folks, I don't have to tell you, when you get in a bad way, things can get ugly real quick. Well, Johnny Ray's been battling this for six months, and it's down to where he's on the road to recovery but it is not financially better for him. He's still struggling. And this morning he put out another auction video with some of his prized possessions. And folks, that's the, that's the nail that gets me right there. I, I can't handle that. I want him to keep his collection. So I'm doing this fundraiser to try and help a friend out. I know y'all do it for me. I've done it for others. So there it is. We got... Uh, Right now, I think, it, oh, shoot, we, Julie H., man, you've really, really stepped up. You've donated a total of $175. Uh, Trudy T., you've come in at 50 Ron F. is at, at 5 Nickel and Dimes got 20 I got 20 and then I added another 50 cash to that deal. So we're getting close to $300 for uh, 
cash funds to send to Johnny Ray as soon as we wrap this up. And I'm going to keep it going. And so here's the entries list. There are 52 people on the list. And each $10 increment gets you an entry. So I hope to see y'all's names on this list. Right now there's only about probably five or six people on this list. I hope you see your name there. If not, do what you can. And folks, I know not everybody's got the money right now to be doing anything so i totally understand all right well let's get on with kc's deal there's my gmail one more time and kc i'm fixing to pop the top on this it still has a cellophane cellophane uh wrapper around the seal and i'm gonna get my pan ready and my water in here and my jet dry and we're going to go through this. So I'm going to pause it right now before I, before I open it and get everything set up. Be right back. All right, here we go. I got the jet dry in, the water in, and we're fixing to break the seal on this uh, Bentley Small Pay Dirt. And this is some good stuff. And also, I, I'd like to mention, too, that on the Bentleys, anytime you purchase a Bentley's Pay Dirt, whatever size it is, uh... It, it, I think it's a certain percentage goes to the uh, SPCA or something like that to help benefit animals that are in shelters and such. And that's in memory of Bentley, which was apparently uh, Lynch Mining's uh, dog for a long time. So here we go, brother. I'm going to put about half of it, I'd say, in there. We'll do a half at a time. Let's see what it looks like. Boy, that's some dirty stuff. I see grass and seeds and all kinds of stuff floating around in there. All right. Well, I'll be right back. I'm going to work this down. If anybody would like to see me actually panning instead of pausing it and then coming back, just leave it in the comments and maybe I'll make a longer video and uh, show more of the panning. So, here it is. It's kind of dirty. It's un unsearched kind of stuff when you see it dirty like that when it's real clean and doesn't have mud in it that means to me it, it's probably been searched all right be right back all right we're back we're getting down to the bottom part of it and i'm seeing some shiny in there and another thing folks let me note to y'all oh man wow look at that there's some pickers in there some nice nuggets small nuggets wow uh, let me note another thing folks. This is about 25% in my opinion black sands Which is not too too bad The it panned out pretty easily, but I am truly surprised at the size of these pickers in this man. This is awesome Man Wow, what a cleanup KC KC you're gonna be tickled with this man. This is just too much. Look at this Look at this folks Oh my gosh, look at the, the pickers and nuggets in that. I don't see too much flower gold or real fine stuff in there, but man, there are some nice chunky pieces in there. All right, I'm going to put this in a bowl for you, and we're gonna, we still got, heck, I don't know, maybe two-thirds of the jar left. So nice, very nice. And if anybody would like to sponsor for something, like one of these jars or something I have. I have a big variety of stuff. Just get in contact with me and we'll talk. All right, I'll be right back. All right, got that all bowled up for you. So let's see what else we can get out of here. We'll do about half of what's left there. We'll save one more little batch here. It ain't much, but we'll do it. All right, here we go, folks. I'm gonna clean this up and I'll be right back. Hope you all enjoying this content. If you are, please hit the like button. And if you'd like to help my channel, please do so. I appreciate every little bit I can get. It keeps the fun stuff going. All right, folks, be right back. All right, here we go. Down to the bottom of the second. Or the, uh, the, uh, the second third of the jar, I guess you'd call it. And let's see, I see a little bit of shiny in there. Yep, starting to come out, all that black sand washing away. Nice. Not as nice as the first one, but hey, this one's not bad. There's, oh man, one picker in there. Wow, go figure. 
hit big on the first one, the second one just one little picker. All right, I'll get that bowled up and we'll be right back with the last of it. All right, here we are. Let's end this with a bang, man. The last of the small Bentley's pay dirt jar. Says it's 1.10 pounds, I guess it is. And uh, all their jars seem to be the same weight as far as the size of them, based on the size. So let's see what we get. I Hopefully we do this last little bit here and get some nice stuff in there. So I'll be right back. All right, here we are, down to the end of it. Man, I greatly appreciate it, KC, and I guarantee you're going to be pleased with those nuggets. You got some nice pickers and some smaller nuggets in that first cleanup for sure. I ain't seeing too much in this one either. I don't know how that could happen as far as getting a... I, I guess it was quite a bit of it the first time we went around, but uh, let's see. There might be some shiny in here. I ain't seeing it. A little bit of black sand. What? Nothing. Not a, not even a picker in that one. So there it is, folks. Let me dump it out here. Let's see what we got for him. Let me tell you, folks. This that first cleanup, that alone. Look at that. Nice, all out of his bowl. And there it is, folks. He got some great, great pickers in there. I would love to add those to my collection for sure. But Casey, those are yours, baby. I'm gonna dry them out, bag them up, and get them ready for shipping. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go through these cons these tellings one more time just in case I miss something because there's no small gold in that. That's all bigger, bigger pieces. So just to be sure, I'll go through it one more time. I'm going to put this back in your little bowl and uh, I won't video it, but I promise you I will go through this tellings one more time. This pan was clean when I started, so anything in here is all yours, brother. All right. Well, once again, thank you again, KC, brother. And uh, pretty nice little clean up there. Not bad. Not bad at all. Try and work out a little bit more of this black sand. All right. Man, look at that. Nice pickers. All right, folks. Well, that's pretty much it in a nutshell. And uh, maybe this weekend I got work Saturday. I hope I'm off Sunday. But, uh. If I have time, I'd like to uh, close the auction on the tailings from the nugget bucket and maybe run that through one of my little mini sluices and talk about some other stuff I got going on. All right, well, I appreciate y'all's time. Don't forget about Johnny Ray, man. That dude needs some help right now. I'm doing everything I can for him. And uh, I greatly appreciate those of y'all who can and those of y'all that are sending prayers and thoughts his way, man. It means the same to me. So, greatly appreciate it. Y'all have a wonderful Friday evening, and I will talk to y'all tomorrow. All right. Well, you know what the old panner says. Later, taters.